we are back. 28 players have been eliminated. All of the stars have made their reservations for the Australian Open. But there is one match to determine who will play the final. Paula Badosa ran out of gas. So now we're down to two left, but only one spot. Somebody's O must go. From the Federation, she's a WTA finalist. Doubles, that is. She's a two-way player, but she's not a sidekick. She's got the skills to pay the bills. Just don't get her mad. Ouch. It's about to be a what? Girl fight. Veronica escapes narrowly, barely. Get focused, Veronica. This is the biggest match of the season for you. She's beat Azarenka, Alexandrova, and Danny Mel Collins. And next up, from Switzerland, Belinda Bensick, one of the hardest baseliners in the game. She's a gold medal winner. She's beat Garbenya Muguruza, Kalins Kaya, and Carolyn Garcia. Let me see you handle those rockets from Air France. Yeah, good luck with that. She's coming off an amazing season where she put up 42 wins. She beat on Jabur at Charleston, rematched her in Berlin. And listen, guys, she made the semifinals at Talon and Miami. And she's facing someone she's beat five times. Ouch. And the last time they played, Veronica Kunamatoa had no answer for the ground strokes. Too powerful. Belinda Bensick's the favorite from Switzerland. Did you see what she did to Carolyn Garcia? Unbelievable. But wait, did you see what Veronica did to Danny Mel? And I like the two way play. I like Veronica Kunamatova getting four and a half games on the alternate spread. That's a lot. And I like Veronica to win at least one set. That's a lot. And we have an upset underdog money line. <laughs> this is good energy. Enjoy. Let's get ready for the Australian Open.